input and output devices are used to enter data and take out results. But how can we see the output after some hours or days? We need to store the output. Once we store the work, it will never get lost. We can see our work later, even after many years. We use some devices to store our work. These devices are known as storage devices. A computer can store our work in different storage devices. Some of the storage devices are hard disk, CD-ROM, DVD, pen drive, etc. Let us read about them. Hard disk. A hard disk is the main storage device. It is fixed inside the CPU. It is used to store large amount of data and information. It is also known as hard drive. CD-ROM drive The full form of CD-ROM is compact disk read-only memory. A CD-ROM is a circular disk. It is used to store data. It is a portable device. DVD The full form of DVD is digital video disk. It is similar in shape to that of a CD but has a large storage capacity as compared to a CD. One can store up to 4.7 GB of data as compared to 700 MB of data capacity of a CD. Pen drive At present, pen drive is the most commonly used storage device. It is so small that it fits in our pocket, keychain, etc. It comes in various storage sizes like 4GB, 8GB, 16GB, 32GB, 64GB and 512GB. Storage Unit 1 bit is equal to 1 binary digit. 8 bits is equal to 1 byte. 1024 byte is equal to 1 KB. 1024 KB is equal to 1 MB. 1024 MB is equal to 1 GB. KB is equal to kilobyte. MB is equal to megabyte. GB is equal to gigabyte. TB is equal to terabyte. New words CD-ROM Compact disk Read only memory. DVD. Digital video disc. CD. Compact disc. So, children, we learned about four different storage devices today, and now we know that hard disk is the main storage device. So, children, a storage device can be a device inside a computer or outside a computer. So, children, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed the session. We'll see you in another session. Till then, take care.